All right, y'all, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show y'all boys how to use Auto Reframe in Premiere Pro. Simple, easy, straight to the point. Let's get to it. What's a flipper? All right, bro. So now that we inside this thing. Let's go and get a crack of lacking. First thing you wanna do, you know what I'm saying? You got Premiere Pro open. You gotta get your resolution right. What you doing? You doing the IG square? You doing the Facebook story? I don't know what you're trying to do. Post on TikTok? Well, choose that, you know what I'm saying? Then go find your video, you know what I'm saying? Go get your video. And come back to me once you got your video. All right, so this is the video I got right here. It's a video from a clip of a music video I shot a while back. And let's say I want to make this an Instagram real type, you know what I'm saying, video. You see the black boys? Not a fan of it. What I want to do, I want to make this full screen. I want the people to be able to see the actual character of the video, you know what I'm saying? So how can we do that? Auto reframe. Let's see how we gonna do it. All right, so this is what we're gonna do. You click the clip, boom. Then you go to a fix. Then you wanna search up auto reframe. Look at it right there, looking out pretty. See that right there? Double click it. <laughs> I don't know if y'all seen that, but it did it just that fast, you know what I'm saying? That little blue bar in the corner, that's the auto reframe right there, bye bye. So you see it zoomed in a little bit, but it actually did more than zoom in a little bit. It zoomed in and it's gonna try to keep the main person in focus. That's the whole point of the auto reframe. 